Uh, here we are on the eve of the examination in public for the Joint Corps Strategy with uh, Keith Simpson, local MP for Broadland, and we feel in snub that it's important that Keith gets to know before the examination in public the strength of the local feeling. And in here we have a petition of 3,200 people. It's been renewed over the summer um, to counter any um, duplication of previous uh, petitions. It's now authenticated in terms of deduping. Um, and we believe this is a genuine response to the planned development in and around the North East Triangle. Uh, so therefore we'd like you to accept it and uh, to make sure Eric Pickles gets it. Yes, um, exactly. So he needs, needs to know what's going on. Yes. Yeah. Okay? Thank, you, thank you very much in, in, indeed. I formally accept um, this petition. Um, as you know, the, um, both the Conservatives and the Lib Dems said before the general election that any development of an eco-town would take seriously into account the views of a of local community. Uh, we've just been in and presented the local MP with the petition that we have gathered over the summer of, uh, of this year, 2010, to uh, represent to him the strength of feeling of the local community around the whole concept of developing in the northeast growth triangle of Norwich, which would spread urbanisation of Norwich City out up, up to the borders of the Norfolk Broads which we believe is uh, not sustainable. Uh, we believe that um, that would ruin the, the countryside in Norfolk. It would take prime agricultural land out of the food chain uh, and we believe that it's not a viable uh, proposition. Uh, that belief is, is, uh, is recognised by the thousands of people who have signed our petition um, and we believe that instead of uh, concentrating new growth and new housing in large developments, it should be spread across the whole county um, and therefore reinforce existing communities and towns that are, are dying on their feet because they, that people are leaving. Uh, uh, and we have completed the petition following best practice guidance and we believe that this is a valid uh, document that we hopefully will now be presented to um, Grant Shapps, the Housing Minister and indeed the Minister of State, Eric Pickles, at Communities and Local Government. And that's what we've asked uh, Keith Simpson to do today and we've also asked him um, to table three parliamentary questions about the whole um, the whole joint call strategy and why it's proceeding and using public money in a time of economic crisis. We have made contact with all of the um, the other campaign groups campaigning against um, the equal towns um, and we are in uh, regular contact and we exchange emails, we exchange um, strategies um, and tactics so that we can learn from each other uh, but our, our campaign is developing now into a much more wider campaign because the Eco Town is just a small part of the thousands of houses that the Joint Core Strategy are calling for. So we need to be measured and say yes the Eco Town is, represents four and a half thousand houses but the Joint Core Strategy is calling for many many more.